like this and grasp your hands together. That's good. Do exactly what I do. Do what I do. Now watch on the count of three. One, two, three. Thumbs up. <laughs> I'm going to explain a little bit about how a magician thinks. Because technically, to a magician, anything is possible. We don't sit around to discuss whether it's possible to float the lady in the air. We sit around and talk about what's the best method. We know it can be done. It's a matter of figuring out the best way to accomplish it. Everyone here, of course, making an investment of their time just by being here at this summit and the meeting. And number two, you uh, took a risk because you just gave a guy that makes things disappear your $20 bill, okay? <laughs> right now, Kyle is doing the third thing everyone must be able to do to achieve success in business. He's reevaluating his situation. <laughs> yeah? yeah. How, what do you see now in a loud voice? A hundred. Yeah, a hundred on the front and on the back. And if you win a hundred dollars, Arnie will kick in a hundred bucks for everyone here, okay? <laughs> if I don't find the car. Your card has changed into the five of diamonds and your signature has completely disappeared. <laughs> okay, you're not... But if I open up this sealed envelope so we can take a look inside, here we have another satisfied... Whoa! Whoa. There it is, your card, your signature. I'll do this at my fingertips so you can see everything happen, but as I said, I didn't want my first trick to end on a sour note. I'll hold on to the glass if you pull it out, and if you can unfold that and open it up, it, in fact, is a $20 bill. But not only is it a $20 bill, there's a corner missing. If you hold out your hand, check out the serial number. Confirm for the entire audience, and they'll be shocked. Damn. It fits. <laughs> it fits. I want you to keep this very card that you put your name on. And I've made a few bucks on that. Inside is something that starts with the letter L. What do you think I have in the briefcase? I'll if you use the childlike portion of your brain, you come up with more creative solutions. Okay, a ladder, okay? Actually, it's a 10-foot ladder. Our ability to visualize and picture things is something we take for granted, okay? But again, it's critical to be able to visualize something that doesn't yet exist. I want you to visualize the cards flying out of the wine bucket into the air, a spray of cards, and I take and impale your selected card on the end of the sword. Just an exercise in imagination, okay? As soon as it comes up in the air, I get one on the end, and it just happens to be your three of clubs. Imagine that. Hmm. Actually, there's more than one solution to a problem, and Sarah, if I draw a line here and a line here, what I did was I drew a full deck of 52 cards. Your card is in there somewhere. The three of clubs is on the... Okay, now it's a valid solution, it's just not the one Sarah was expecting. Name your card. The Ace of Diamonds. And once you know what you're looking for, sometimes you can actually see it literally start to happen right before your eyes. And there it is, you'll get the Ace of Diamonds. And once you get what you're looking for, you can actually sign your name on it just like this, and we'll put a date. And the best part is that leaves you with a permanent result. And there it is, Sarah's Ace of Diamonds. A nice round of applause for Sarah. Penelope. Thank you, Sarah. Penelope. Thinking outside the box. We all hear that phrase, but do they ever show you the box? No. <laughs> this is the box they want you to think outside of. It's precisely 15 inches square. First, we have to start by expanding the brand. And we do that. You make the box bigger. And you end up with a bigger box and the growth that you're all looking for. It involves a little risk, but I like a risk taker, okay? Great, that's perfect, perfect. That's service, support, all in one compact package, that's Unilever. When it comes to packaging, I understand you have solutions that get right to the point. I'll take a close look, around, in back, behind. It all comes down to a relationship between you and the customer. I can, of course, rely on my partner, Catherine. And there she is! Nice